The different types of radiation therapy depend on the amount of breast area that's being treated. So one type is whole breast radiation therapy. A second type is partial breast radiation therapy. And then there are times we have to treat the lymph node, where the lymph nodes were, and up here above the collarbone, because these are areas with a high positive count of lymph nodes that the cancer could recur. Most of the time, radiation therapy is called adjunctive therapy. It's in addition to chemotherapy, surgery, and it adds on to the benefit of those other two treatments. Whole breast radiation therapy typically takes six weeks. The first five weeks, the whole breast is being treated, and then there's a boost to the area where the cancer was. Partial breast radiation therapy can be done by putting a device in the breast that gives 10 treatments over five days, twice a day, or another type of partial breast radiation therapy is called intraoperative radiation therapy. The intraoperative radiation therapy can be done as a single one-time treatment or it can be done as a boost and then followed by the radiation therapy of the breast. So remember, these are adjunctive therapies. These are in addition to surgery and possibly uh, chemotherapy and are all designed to help with what's called local regional control of the cancer. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.